Hey guys, I'm back for another review. I am a Facebook junkie. I'm on Facebook quite often and I notice especially lately there's always all these beauty ads on my feed. So I stumbled across these hair extensions by Daisy Fuentes. They're like hair extensions for dummies because you don't have to clip on anything. It looks so easy. It's almost comical how easy it looks. Oh, I did buy two sets and I believe it's buy two and you get a better deal. So I think it was buy, oh, let's see if the receipt is in here. The first set I bought is $39.99 and then the second one is $29.99. And I paid a total of $69.98 for the two. And there's tons of different shades to choose from. I think there's about 10 different shades. So I picked black. I appreciate that the packaging is pretty simple and just straight to it. So you're not paying and wasting a lot for packaging. So that's nice. Take this out. It seems like very little hair. Cause I've, I've tried on hair extensions before, but there's like a lot of them and they're really heavy. But this one seems pretty small. Oh my gosh, this looks like my hair. It's really soft and it looks like real hair. And here's the string. For some reason, I thought the string was gonna be clear, but it's kind of like a dark brown. So I'm supposed to put the hair behind me, put the elastic over my face. Kind of like I'm putting on uh, an elastic hairband. All right, put it over my hair, and then bring the sides of my hair in front. I would be surprised if you could actually, oh, whoa, you could actually tell a difference. This does seem like a lot. It feels weird though. I feel like it's about to slip off. Okay, so my hair is a little longer than these extensions. Let's see if it's really invisible. You know, I feel like my hair really does look fuller and it blends in nice. So this is happening as I'm pulling my hair back like this. It's pulling some of my actual hair and it's making it look really weird. If I were at the club and I was dancing and I'm just going like this, having a gay old time. Mm. Do not wear this to the theme parks. It just came right off. Okay, let's try to put it a little closer towards the front of my face. You know these secret hair extensions? They're not new. It's been around for a few years, at least two years now. So I personally like it closer to the forehead because I feel like I have more security. Just like if you were to wear an elastic hair headband, you don't want to wear it back here because it's gonna like slip off. And especially since this is holding some weight, but it still feels lightweight. This is not bad at all. Even though it is synthetic hair, it says here in the instructions that you can use styling tools up to 320 degrees. So I heated up my curling iron, but I don't need it because it already has like a curl in it. Anyway, so this is what they do in the infomercial. And they say that you can double up different colors so you could have like an ombre effect. It's pretty heavy. This is starting to feel a little heavy. And I don't know if you can tell a difference. I mean, I do have a lot of hair and I have thick hair, but this does seem extra va va voom. It's really easy. I like that it's affordable. Um, because hair extensions, especially if you get the real hair, that can cost a few hundred dollars. So far, I say it's a good buy, but the real test is trying this out in real life and wearing it throughout the day. Let's see how well it holds up. It is almost 12 in the afternoon. I'll check back in a few hours. 
almost 3 in the afternoon. Yeah, so uh, this happened about 30 minutes ago and I was just tired of fixing my hair because I was literally, I was, I'm not even kidding you, I'm like this every 15 to 20 minutes when I look in the mirror. Every time I look left to right or I'm do doing whatever, the hair will creep up and it just looks so weird. So I went to Ulta and you know, thank goodness, there's mirrors everywhere and I caught like a piece of hair sticking up. So I'm like going like this and I felt so awkward because I, you know, it looks like I'm picking something in my hair or I was just playing with my hair way too much while I was there. It was especially irritating while I was driving because I'm looking to my left and my right, just checking my blind side and I could feel my hair tugging and the bottom part would shift. So that was constantly happening and I, it just felt like all I could think about were these hair extensions while I was out. So far it's not going too well. Um, and I wonder if it's because I doubled up and I have these two. What I'm gonna do for the rest of the day is just wear one of the hair extensions and see how it goes. Maybe it won't pull on my hair as much. Okay guys, so this feels significantly lighter. It makes almost like a night and day difference removing that. But then again, you can tell that it's definitely not as voluminous. Is it voluminous or voluminous? Can't hear me. So I'm gonna go on with my day. I will check back in a few hours or maybe at the end of the day. It is 10.30 in the evening, but it's definitely been much more manageable. Like I kind of forgot that I had them on. It just wasn't as heavy and it didn't flinch around as much. And I think like the last two hours, I had my hair up in hair clips. So I just pulled it all up like this with no problems. With one set, I didn't really have any issues. But then again, I just don't notice a significant difference. Let me remove this and then We'll see. See? Not much. If you want to add a little bit of volume and you have thin hair, get this as long as it is your hair length. Maybe a few inches below your shoulders, this will blend in nice. Otherwise, if you have like hair to your chin, it probably won't blend as seamless. So pros, I like the idea and the simplicity of it. I think it's straight to the point, it's easy, and it's simple. Like, it's good if you want instant volume for your hair. Cons, I feel like one set really isn't enough. I don't think it's gonna make a significant difference. Nope. No, 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 don't. However, with two, you're gonna have definitely more volume. Um, but then, on the downside, it's too heavy when you have two sets on. It's totally like an inconvenience. It kind of clings onto your hair and then you have like, oh my gosh, it was just, it was really annoying. Overall, I'd say this is beneficial if you have like a photo shoot, maybe you're going to an event for like an hour or two and that doesn't require lots of dancing. You definitely cannot whip your hair back and forth or else this thing is gonna come flying off. You wanna try mommy's hair? Yeah. Is it, is it, is it? Wow. <laughs> is it awesome. Awesome. All right guys, so that's my thoughts on the extension. Comment below if you've tried this and your thoughts. Thumbs up if you found this review helpful. Don't forget to check out my other channels. It's Mommy's Life where I vlog fun videos with my kiddos. And also check out my daily vlog channel where I vlog almost every yeah. single day. Thank you so much for watching and we will see you later. Bye guys!